Hello sports fans, Ralph Luck here. Welcome to RVing with Luck. Today I thought I'd just do a, a simple little day in the forest by myself with Ninja back there sleeping as she does during the day. It's about 3 p.m., a little late in the afternoon, midweek. And, uh, uh, but today you see my paper plate here ready gonna do just a simple little lunch one of my favorites part of my head chopped off but here we go let you know what I'm getting we've got the artesian bread sliced pepper jack cheese oh no the last of my tomato maybe onion And some black forest ham, a little mayo, a little Dijon mustard, and we'll get out the soda afterwards. So, to me, nothing makes a sandwich taste fresh. Pleh, fresh like some onion and tomato. There we go. And there we go on that one. Although I have plenty of onion and a couple more, one or two more. I do not have any more tomato, but that's okay couple of days I plan on going into town and getting some more just a few groceries and I have the brioche artesian bread I think that's how it's pronounced nice and thick but yet very fresh and fluffy tasting and yes as I mentioned before I keep my bread in the fridge just helps it uh, last a little longer since I'm not eating a ton of it every day or every week. Love this Sargento pepper jack cheese. Put that over there. This will be trash. Let's see what we're going to do first. Let's do the onion. I'll have to spread that out throughout the sandwich a little bit. So every bite I get a little crunchy bit of that. Same with the tomato, but thin slices in the middle. Then I do have on my list to get some more lunch meat. I do the Land O Frost. This is a old world style black forest ham and just something about this has such a good taste to it otherwise I do a lot of chicken okay we're gonna leave just a little bit for another sandwich so based on the tomato and the lunch meat got one sandwich left now I do a little real mayonnaise. Ah! It's a little really too much real mayonnaise. Best foods, real mayonnaise. I guess as opposed to their fake mayonnaise. A little Dijon mustard. You know, isn't it the worst when you put on like some mustard and it all comes out watery? Ah. I think I'm going to spice this up a little bit. with some jalapenos. Okay, don't do this at home, kids. Oh. Now my hands are clean. If I was using a fork for anything, I'd get out a fork, but right now I'm just being a little lazy. 
and let's just put a few randomly placed just to kick it up a notch come on one more ought to do sorry if you can't see that there we go just a couple strategically placed we're gonna do this and give it a good squashing down now I'll put away everything and enjoy a nice sandwich. That's all there is to it. Got some chips, wheat thins. I don't know if I have any delicious Dorito Cool Ranch anymore. I'm pretty sure I killed those off with the ranch dressing in one of my recent shorts. But I'll get a little chips just to have a little mix. As I said, it's ice cold Diet Coke. Pull the flap up, let the sun in, because you can see there's great breeze here. Forgot where we're at, like 72 today in northern Arizona. Just beautiful, just beautiful. So quiet, I love it. So, I hope you like my simple lunch. Thanks for watching. Please give this a thumbs up, and if you haven't already, subscribe. You have a great day.